Have you ever wondered about content that you thought was lost forever? Surprisingly, there has been discoveries that led to some content into being found again. For this video, we'll be talking about lost media that is now found. Disclaimer, there will be some topics on this list that will be very controversial and is not meant to be taken for granted. Without being said, let's get onto the video and take a look to see what we found. On Halloween of 1998, Trey Parker and Matt Stone had created an online animation based off of one of the most iconic shows of all time, South Park. The animation was called A Mother's Courage. The plot would involve the boys carving a pumpkin to make it look like Lou Diamond Phillips. Meanwhile, Cartman would eat a bag of candy corns until he puked at the end. The short was taken down and redone in its comic form, but the animation was nowhere to be found. The animation remained forgotten and lost until 2015 where the username Madness uploaded the animation onto YouTube. I'll leave the video link down in the description below. On January 31st of 2007, LED Moon and Night signs were placed around Boston as an advertising and marketing campaign for Aqua Teen Hunger Force, also abbreviated as ATHF. The LED Moon and Night signs were supposed to advertise for the then upcoming Aqua Teen Hunger Force colon movie, but that idea went horribly wrong. Many controversies and panic occurred after mistaking the LED signs for an explosive device by the Boston Fire and Police Department. The incident would have caused Cartoon Network General Manager Jim Samples to pay about $2 million in damages. As a result, the episode Boston never aired on Adult Swim in order to avoid backlash involving the incident. Similar to the Dexter's Laboratory episode Rude Removal, the Boston episode was brought up by fan demand to make a petition and release the episode to the public. However, Adult Swim didn't respond to fan demands, going completely silent. On January 31st of 2015, eight years exactly after the incident, the incomplete version of the Boston episode was leaked onto YouTube. Unfortunately, the original video was removed by YouTube, but fans were able to re-upload the episode and it's currently available online. Business is business. Is that what you're doing here? I am a son. What am I up to? Exactly what you've been your whole life. Zero. Shake. This is certainly not moral, and it's definitely not legal. So what are you, a priest or a lawyer? Just help me out. An episode of The Adventures of Super Mario Bros. 3, titled Mind Your Mummy Mommy Mario, had a song that was originally featured in the episode. The song was called Wipeout, however it was removed from the final version of the episode and was later replaced by The Feud of Fazanadu, which is a song that was featured from the Captain N The Game Master soundtrack. There was a difference between the original version and the final version of the episode. The original version of the song cannot be found in English since it was only available for Spanish, Finnish, German, Greek, Italian, and Swedish audiences. The restoration of the episode can be found online by using an alternative language track. Unfortunately, the English version remains lost and obscured until September 9th of 2018. That's when the user Kobe A. Blanchett uploaded the original 1990 airing onto his channel and is now available to watch. This item is a bit more sexual. If you're uncomfortable with subjects that involve with sexual topics, you may skip to the next item on the list. Miss Peach World is a bootleg version of the previous NES game called Menace Beach. The bootleg version of the game was released by Hacker International. Very little change had occurred on the game other than the fact that the main hero is a girl instead of a boy. One cutscene would have naked pictures of the woman instead of the girl tied up in ropes, which is pretty weird. 
The game was sold over $200 in Japan, making the game extremely hard to obtain. The game hasn't been released to the public and it remained obscure until August 26, 2017. That's where Lost Levels user Famic posted a ROM image of the game. Reproduction of the game still exists, but it's very limited for now. But there is some footage online. The California Raisins The Grape Escape is an unreleased game produced by Capcom for the 1991 release on the NES. The plot would have involved the mascot of California Raisins to save his fellow raisins and musical notes from the wild bunch. The game was cancelled in the 1990s due to the decline of the mascot's popularity. The prototype of the game would remain obscure until 2003 when it resurfaced online by Brandon Murphy. Many game collectors were hacking with Murphy to sell the game to the public. Luckily, a collector had received the game from Murphy, followed by a ROM image released on August 1st, 2003. Sometime around Halloween of 1983, a 35-minute film was released onto the Disney Channel titled Tim Burton's Hansel and Gretel. Despite it being a Japanese-style performance of the original Brothers Grimm story, the film was commissioned by Disney with the budget of $116,000. The film was hosted by Vincent Price from the previous 1982 Burton short called Vincent. The short was very embarrassing for Burton back when it first premiered on the Disney Channel. The film was very dark and too frightening for children as it never aired again. After Burton worked on Frank and Weenie in 1984, he was fired from the Disney company while the Hansel and Gretel short was nowhere to be seen again. It remained obscured for decades until late 2009 where a copy of the short was found. Unfortunately, the short had limited access screenings at the time of its rediscovery. In 2011, a user named Tapio1985 uploaded a camcorder bootleg of Price's intro, but he couldn't upload the entire film due to the video link constraints of YouTube back in the early days. Once again, the short remained obscured until 2014 when a user named Reese's uploaded a VHS rip of the entire short onto YouTube. He stated that, he had acquired the rip from an unnamed source who had recorded it during its lone 1983 airing. Now, the film has been found and is available to watch online. These walls are my ears. These windows are my eyes. I'm always watching you. And you can't you make something that we can sell besides these useless toys? When we all start to death, it'll be your fault. <laughs> Hi guys, Sakura Stardust here. I hope that you guys like the video and subscribe to Red Boy Paul for more content like this. Also, don't forget to subscribe to myself, Sakura Stardust. I hope you all take care and I will see you next time.